Hello everybody and welcome back to a brand new video. This time on my restaurant. Now, when I play games, I always look at the game passes. And they are always pretty straightforward. But in this game, there was one game pass that I had kind of questions about. So, what did I do? I went to YouTube and searched it up. And to my surprise, nobody did a video about this game pass. So, let me spend my money so you don't have to. Welcome to a brand new episode of Is It Worth It? So, in this episode, we will be looking at the Rich Customers Game Pass in the game My Restaurant. And before we buy this, I want to say I am kind of scared. It is kind of expensive, 1200 Robux, and it has quite a lot of dislikes compared to the likes which is never a good sign. The description says, makes some customers leave you money bags full of cash instead of a few dollars, 25% chance per customer. And this is scary because yes, we know how rare it is that they will leave the money bags, but we have absolutely no idea how much a gold bag is worth. It can be 1.5 times cash, it can be 2 times cash, it can be 10 times cash. We have no idea and that is kinda scary. So, you can find this game pass by going to the left to the menu and clicking on boosts. Then we see a whole lot of cash grab boosts. Ignore all of them. Go to passes and there we see Rich customers for 1200 Robux. I guess there's only one thing left to do. Let's buy the game pass. Oof, okay, we got it. Purchase successful. Thank you so much. To test out the power of the Rich Customers Game Pass, I set up this little experiment room and Kyle and Dennis will give me assistance on giving the customer the best treatment he deserves. So hopefully he leaves a money bag. So let's call in the chefs, shall we? Oh chefs! Seems like our second customer went for the spaghetti. Please note that the spaghetti is worth 25 cash. Let's see if she leaves a money back and see how much cash that will be worth. Oh, we did get a money back and we got 63 cash, which is more than double. But now the question remains. Is the money back value based on the food or not? Let's find out, shall we? And to test it out, we made some adjustments to the testing room. We added a lot more chairs and a lot more tables. Let's bring in the customers. Now that the customers that will be helping us in this experiment have come in, let's find out if the gold bags actually scale with the product that they buy. And let's see how many gold bags we can actually get. After letting the customers eat for a while and observing, I can indeed confirm that the money bags are based off the stuff that the customer buys. And oh boy, I gotta tell you, seeing that 750 cash pop up in like orange, that was satisfying, wow. That was really cool. I do gotta say, it doesn't feel exactly like 25%, but it could just be me, maybe I'm just unlucky. But that is something to keep in mind. It doesn't feel like 
Ah, so I guess we arrived at the part that everybody was waiting for. Is it worth it? First of all, the price is kinda high for just a money increase, so it has some negative points in that. I will also give some negative points in not giving enough information on the Game Pass page. When you sell a Game Pass like this, you have to be absolutely sure that the audience that will be buying it knows exactly what they are getting. And unfortunately, they don't. They don't know how much money increase it is, so that's kind of a shame. On the other hand, it does really help increase the money that you get. And 25% isn't that rare, so it will activate a lot. As my final verdict, I think I would give this Game Pass a 6.9 out of 10. Do I suggest you buying it? Maybe. It kind of depends. It kind of depends on a few factors. First, do you believe in the game? Do you think this game will get enough updates to stay relative enough for you to play or even for others to play? Secondly, are you already in Endgame? I feel like this Game Pass is more tailored towards early game and mid game. Because in Endgame you're just gonna have all royal tables anyway. And does it really matter then that you get more cash? Probably not. So at that point I wouldn't say it's really worth it anymore. But if you want to support the development of the game or just want to make a little bit more cash in general, you can always buy the Game Pass. But for me, I feel like I have to experiment a little bit more with it to say if I actually find it worth it. Because at this moment in time, I would actually just say, maybe. It really depends on you and if you see this game having a future in your Roblox life. But anyway guys, thank you all so much for watching. If you like this video and want to see more, please hit that like and subscribe button. And I will see you guys in the next episode. Bye bye!